All right, so let's go ahead and actually install the Jetion software. That way we can remotely view the image on the unit on our computers. Uh, this is ideal for those of you that wanna have that mounted on a tripod, the laptop a little further in, perhaps an interceptionist desk or a guard desk, uh, or just giving some clearance from where the readings are happening. Now the software will come in two different uh, packages. And what I mean is how it's compressed here. Uh, you may get one that says .rar. If you download the official distribution from our site, T Equipment, you'll get the one that has already everything uncompressed. RAR is just a compression here. If you happen to get this, I would recommend you use something like 7-zip. Um, again, that will help you expand out the RAR file just by right-clicking it, 7-zip, and extract it. Now, let's go ahead and actually open this. You will get a manual included in there. We like to keep things easy. You can go ahead and look at some of the settings, options. There's a lot in here um, that you can actually configure on the unit. Again, we're gonna cover a lot of these settings on the next couple of videos. Let's go ahead and install the software. And the installation process for this is actually one of the simplest ones that I have looked at uh, recently, apart from, you know, the other units here, uh, the Seek Scan in particular. Um, Jetion has done a nice job putting everything in here. Everything is digitally signed. There is no additional uh, things you have to do or steps that are easy to miss. This one's all in one place. Um, another thing to mention on this unit while the installation finishes here is that the unit itself has an awesome price if you ask me this is a pretty nice unit um, does its job very well so now the application is installed don't worry this looks like there's nothing in here this is actually just the application itself up until you plug in your unit so i'm going to go ahead and plug the unit in and notice that it's giving me the side profile again it's looking at me from the side here currently um, so out of the box, this is what the software does. So again, I have a USB uh, A to USB C connection. The unit itself is that USB C connection, and this is the software. Next couple of videos will cover some of the functionality and how to change some options here.